Rob Charlemagne's got a weight problem and would never win a conventional beauty pageant. But when he starts to dance, this doesn't seem to matter. Rob has been a dance instructor for more than 10 years. He's not your kind of classical image of your, of your virile male athlete. However, when he started to dance, it was a completely different picture. This guy turned into a live, athletic, uh, physically superior male. Women say all the time that they really love a man who can dance, who is a good dancer. It's giving off a very strong sexual signal. You don't need to be young. You know, you can be any size, any age. As you can see, because Robert is a big guy, there's no doubt about that. You know, I've heard people say, oh, look at him, can he move, you know, because, you know, his size. The minute they see him move, it's a different story. They think he's absolutely wonderful. But it's not just on the dance floor or the athletic field that movement can be a turn-on. People have shown that, for example, the way that, that women walk with the kind of hip shimmy, males find that very, very attractive indeed. Research now suggests that in a busy crowd or a nightclub, we often pick out the age, sex, health, and even social status of another person simply by watching the way they move. It's all information we need to find a suitable partner. And that's the key to attraction. At a biological level, it's about finding mates with whom to have children. Beauty could be acting as a kind of allure, as, a, as an entrapment to find a good quality mate. That's the reason that we're all here, basically, is to find somebody to breed uh, and to have children. That's why being attracted to someone sparks a powerful physical chain reaction. The sight of a potential partner starts the pupils dilating. And if the gaze is returned, men and women's brains pump out a feel-good chemical called dopamine. Adrenaline races through our bodies, diverting blood from our stomach, giving us butterflies and a feeling of intense excitement. And finally, blood rushes to our lips and sexual organs, Beauty has done its job instantly by preparing us for sex. So are there any physical features which trigger this dramatic reaction? Fashion models like Hannah and Jason should give us some clues. Their looks are widely accepted as beautiful, so much so they get paid to flaunt them. So you rotate your body around. That's it, yeah, exactly. When I was 16, I was spotted by a scout in, in Helsinki, in Finland, and got into modeling that way. And when I got to London, I wasn't really planning on doing it anymore, but was spotted in, in the streets again. Head slightly more to me. That's it, that's it. Hannah's good look stood out from an early age. A future as a model beckoned. Jason's striking looks created a similar buzz with the model agencies. So a key characteristic of beauty is that it's instantly recognized. But it isn't easy to define. Well-proportioned face, um, tall, uh, usually thin. Everybody knows that something is or is not beautiful, attractive, handsome, pretty, etc. But the actual qualities that define that are really quite difficult to pin down. 